Good morning. So, do you guys ever wish that you could get some stuff sent to you? I'm not talking shopping and all that. I'm talking like your mail or possibly like a prescription or something like that. I've got a very interesting fact that I found out and uh, I'm going to tell you all about it on our way down to pick up an Amazon delivery just down in the town. So, come with me. Oh, yep, we got a little Amazon parcel to go and put, collect. Basically, it's a new data SIM card because I'm fed up with this not having any internet. And uh, so we're going to have a different SIM card, but we'll go more into that later on. But let's get going and I'll tell you all about this, what I found out. Just hope I don't meet the tractors on the way in because they're cutting the uh, maize this morning and they were doing it yesterday and they're in and out, in and out, in and out, which is not a problem. Just a little bit, there it comes now. Just a little bit scary when they come around the corner. Let's make a break for it. This storage yard here is so busy. It's been pretty much non-stop. I mean, it's Thursday now. It's been non-stop since we arrived on Monday. Anyhow, let's get talking about it. So, things that you might want posting to you could be, you know, important documents you've got to sign. Uh, things like, in my case, it's my prescription because of uh, being registered in Scotland. It's a little bit different up there. Um, for sending to other chemists. You only get a few that are nominated and things like that. So basically I've been looking for a way to get some stuff sent to me and my prescription um, that involves using the Royal Mail. Now there's a service called Post Restant. Now Restant is spelled R-E-S-T-A-N-T-E. <coughs> I think it's a French word or something like that. So basically, I'd never, I never knew nothing about a, about it. But a postmistress in a local village post office said to me when I inquired if it was possible that it was. So when I googled it up, I'm going to put it up on the screen now, and you can have a read. But basically, what it is is you can have your mail sent to a post office for you to go and collect. Now, now you need to obviously check with that post office that they're happy to do it. They should do it. It is a Royal Mail service. It's a Royal Mail service that they provide. So it's no bother. Now I would suggest that you only do this when you're there for enough time for it to arrive like in my case, if I know we're waiting on a prescription, I wait till I'm on the site for at least uh, two weeks. Right now, it did only take, when I used it uh, three weeks ago, I used it and it did only take three days. And there it was, nice, the letter arrived with my prescription inside it. I then took my prescription down to Boots, filled it the normal way that you do, uh, paid for it and all the rest of it. But I also had some letters sent to me. That way you can have, I say, important documents. If you've got something you've got to sign or, or whatever, or something that you really, really need, it's a great way to get it sent to you. But as I say, do go in and to the post office and say, like, are you okay with doing post restaunt? Make sure before you think. I, I, that's what I would advise. And also, on the back of the letter, it does say that the sender wherever it's coming from must put their return address so we did that and uh yeah no bother but it's it's a game changer for me because i've been sending my prescriptions to family members and began collecting it from them and then going off and, and getting it done don't need to do that now uh, now that we're in wales as well we haven't got any family members in wales or not that i know of um so you can, I, for me, it's a game changer. I'll be able to get my prescription and everything. So I just wanted to share that one with you. 
while we're uh, going on to things. It's called Post Restaunt. Just uh, look it up on Google. But uh, here's the page and uh, what the post office says all about it. And it's not just for this country, it's for Europe too. So I think it's uh, brilliant. Anyway, I'll talk to you in a minute when we get to the co op. We got it. This is a major mega. M A G O R. I don't know how you say that really. Watch. Magor, maybe. It says it's got a historic square, so let's have a little look, shall we? Oh, there is actually a post office here as well. So if I was going to be using the post restaurant for here, which I'm not, I would just go in and say World War One. Sure. There's the local little church through there and stuff. There's a pizza place here. Ooh. Doing nothing today. We had a massive loads of walks yesterday and stuff. And we're off in a day or so, so. Been finding it quite hard to book sites up. Um, most of them have been full. So what this should be, should be a three network preloaded data sim that lasts for two years because we only want it for emergencies and uh yeah it's got 24 gigabytes on it uh, it was i think 30 quid not the cheapest i know but we're getting really really sick we we pay 40 quid a month for ee uh, unlimited data but we're not even getting hardly anything from it and the last last three sites have been shocking can't upload got a little bit of download and again same here there's literally on the upload it's not even registering so and download just breaks down every two minutes so it's kind of unusable you pay forty pound a month. You shouldn't be getting that. Not in twenty twenty three. You know, it's not five G we're after. It's four G. So, well, we're going to see how it goes with this. If we don't find an answer soon, I should be cancelling the EE contract. To be quite honest with you, because we we're into. We're second year now, so we'll just c cancel it, and they can fight me for it. So yeah, so I say this was all about sort of chatting to you about post restaurant. So give it a go if it's something that will help you. We're going to be doing a, a little little series of uh, videos because you guys said in the comments you'd like to see some tips sort of videos. So I thought I'd start off with that one because it was something that I'd recently used. Oh my god. And uh, I'll see you back at the farm. Okay, so the free sim works. Um, it's not enough to upload a video, but there is another signal. So when we move from here in a couple of days should be, hopefully, if we're out in the open, we are a bit close to some trees here. So hopefully, you know, that will solve problems anyway hope this has been helpful for you guys and uh we'll see you on the next tips video or in the next vlog coming out shortly bye for now